E. What's going on, guys? Brigalu here, and uh, yeah, I'm playing COD again, which I haven't haven't done that intro or haven't played Call of Duty in like forever. I haven't played Cold War since I think the uh, six months ago. It was like League Play, and then I haven't played. That's that's the last time I haven't played Cold War. The last time I played COD was probably what the second beta of. Uh, whatever the new one is called, Vanguard. Because Vanguard comes out actually like tomorrow or today, I guess, by the time I upload this. But I'm going to be playing, uh, you know, the last day of Cold War, Call of Duty. Black Ops Cold War. Season whatever the fuck, 24 or whatever. Get my last game, my last couple games, and then I'm, I'm also going to be showing my final stats. Oh, I forgot the. I always forget whenever I play oh, card that the fight. fucking. Yeah. That my sprint buttons are just constantly fucked. Oh yeah, I can't attack sprint? Fuck. I keep double pressing it to, t to tax sprint. I literally have not played this game in about six months. We're falling behind. I've played Vanguard. We've taken the lead. But that's different. Man, I couldn't even believe. No. Oh yeah, I heard you can you can sprint, you can uh, not sprint, you can slide though. Fuck. <laughs> I'm pressing the button to move, and the guy's just like, my dude's like, nah. Pack available. Right clear. I'm gonna just camp this shit. Oh, there's a guy there. Ah, uh, I actually didn't even know that like, was it like Vanguard was coming out in a couple of days? It's literally like tomorrow or today, I guess, by the time you see this. But I'll, I'll be streaming Vanguard too, because I pre-ordered it, because I played the beta. So I'll be streaming it uh, probably tomorrow at 9, I guess, if it follows every other... Um, fucking game, fucking... No! If it follows like every other fucking release, Call of Duty release, like the last couple years, it'll be I think 9 p.m. my time because I'm uh, West Coast. So, and since like since it comes out essentially, it comes out Friday, like the 5th, I think. But because West Coast is, I didn't realize it was getting behind me. But because West Coast is like three hours behind, um. Why is he spawning behind me? I think I read the visa. Out. I forgot they added the like, score streaks in this game, too. The heck just. Did the car blow me up? Oh, that's so fucking stupid. <laughs> oh, he's here. Uh, yeah, it'll be like 9, 9 p.m. West Coast time. And I'm West Coast, so. That'll be fucking good. For that shit. Um, so yeah, probably, probably not them PSP. Time, I'll be streaming some Vanguard. And we're just mowing down this basement. 
Oh, I finally got my helicopter. Requesting the game, <laughs> Oh, I want to get four kills. What do I got? 29 10? Not too bad considering I haven't played in months. It's a little six months. But I think, I fear the, after this first game, the. What's it called? The uh, skill based matchmaking is gonna come into effect and fuck me in the ass. I remember I used to be like so hyped about, like so excited for the next Call of Duty games to drop and I was like, oh, I would love it. But now I'm just like, I'm just like indifferent about it. I'm like, okay, cool. Like a new, like a, <laughs> I'm like, all right, like another COD game. All right, I guess I'll get it. At this point, I'm just getting it just cause it's like a legacy <laughs> at this point. I'm like, well, I've just played with it for so long. I'll just keep buying the new games. But it's like, I'm not, I don't get super excited about them anymore, I'm just kinda like, like, that the game is actually just, it's gonna be caught. It's not gonna be insanely more crazy or less crazy, it's not gonna be like, it's not gonna suddenly just be a different game. It's gonna be mind blowing, but it's not, like, unless they completely ruin the fucking game, it's not gonna be fucking horrible either, but like, it's just, it's just caught. It's, a, it's a literally gonna be another Call of Duty game. Call of Duty game that has been around for the last, like, 10 years or so. The last decade, it's gonna be the exact same. You spawn into a map, you run around and shoot and kill people with guns that have slightly different time to kills and all that shit. <laughs> like, I just don't get like excited about them anymore. Like the past three games, I haven't really been that excited. But hopefully, they can load me in soon. But like, what is it? World World War Two. Um, this game and now. What's the next one? Another World War II? Oh yeah, Vanguard game. It's just like, okay, it's cool, I guess. But it's just, I don't know. It's just another COD, like it's it's just literally just COD. Man, they're getting destroyed. I told you immediately, like, I had one good game right in the beginning. Because I hadn't played in six months and they're like, oh, okay. Let's give you like a normal lobby, and now they're like, and now they're like, oh wait, you had a three KD? Oh, okay, never mind. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna use our skill based map making over. Our, our skill based matchmaking will be fucking. We're gonna turn it on full blast now. Like, express raid, nuketown, standoff, hijacked, rush, slums, driving. Wait, they had a driving in zoo. That must have been like with this, uh, the latest patch or the latest um, DLC maps that they added. Like I guess season four. Yeah, I don't know. It was an alright game. I didn't fucking. I didn't think it was horrible. I didn't. It's definitely not my favorite COD. Honestly, I think I liked. I like the maps more in this one. Or no. Yeah, I like the maps more. In this one, compared to Modern Warfare 2019, but I liked I liked the gun play more in Modern Warfare 2019. The problem was like the maps were kind of like just so ass. Every single year, as the new COD comes out, I just play less and less of it. I just I've played less and less COD per year, I guess. God, this is so weird. Because I remember playing this game, or this map. I don't know, like, I wish I had played... Black Ops 2 more, like, it was honestly such, such a good game. I just didn't, like, appreciate it at the time, because I was like... Because Mod Modern Warfare 3 was my favorite game, or it is, it's my favorite Call of Duty. So like, right after that it went to like Black Ops 2 and I was like, I just didn't like Black Ops 2 at the time because it came right after, but now it's like, I miss that shit, I wish I had like, played that shit. When, when it was like, fucking out, you know? 
Die, you son of a bitch. Oh, there's a guy here. No! Why are the walls made of fucking fucking mache? I got a fucking beat hole right at the end of the game. Shit. 5 11 right. Good, work. Good one better. I don't know why they keep trying to like reinvent the wheel. It's like the same thing with like ranked or league play. Like like whenever they, they first they never like do a league play. I don't know why. So I'm trying to reinvent the wheel. Just fucking do like what Overwatch does, what League of Legends does, what every other fucking what Black Ops 2 did. Like just every other call, every other system that has like a good ranking system. It's just like. Do bronze, silver, gold, diamond, or plat, diamond, masters, and then like, you know, just have like a system like that. Don't do these weird like tiers. Don't do like Black Ops 4 that had like, I don't know, 8,000 different tiers or something, and then do not do the one in this one where it's like fucking. Securing Enemy You're in like bronze, silver, gold, and then you have like. Secure. Just do like a ELO system. Like, how's it. How's it so hard to just be like, yeah, fucking just gonna do it. Go, okay, T Man, I'll cover you. Never mind. <laughs> the DLC maps too? Like, they're alright, I guess. They're good, but like. I don't know, it's kind of tough, because most of it's just like. They're really good, like, you know, like, these throwback maps are fucking cool. But it's like, I already know these maps are good, because they're fucking from Black Ops 2 or from Black Switching Ops 1. Like, I've played them before, I like them, I know that they're good. I mean, it's Call of Duty Vanguard, but it's basically just... It's Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019, with, like, a new skin, essentially. So the maps are kind of ass. I don't know, you can just get, you you can just get shot from like everywhere and like spawns are like insane in that game. Like you can just, you can literally just spawn into people. They'll spawn behind you. Just like there's no there's no really rhyme or reason why the fuck what the like what the fuck is happening. The guns are rare. the guns are right. The, I think the gunfights aren't too bad. It was it was kind of really bad like in um. Pack they like toned it down a little bit. I hope they tone it down a little bit more too. Where like, where like you shoot the gun and then there's a fucking huge ass like muscle, muscle. There's like a huge ass muzzle flash and all that shit. The maps just like don't aren't that good. It's like everyone's everywhere, and the spawn the spawns are everywhere. Everyone just can go everywhere. You can get shot from like eight thousand different corridors. Every single building has like a fucking window. Every single building has like three floors, you've got a fucking... It's just like, ah, oh, just give me, give me three lane maps. I feel there's that much cheese shit right in the game again too, like this fucking... Bullshit ass double shotgun. What? Why do they always do that? I don't understand... Why in every single fucking Call of Duty game... They're like, we're gonna fucking give you shotguns, you can, you can run them double field, double... Fucking pumped, don't worry, you can fucking do that. We're gonna have place and forget explosives. So you can just run in and fucking... What? How did he get there? Oh, he just... What? Okay. We're gonna have a fucking C4, we're gonna have fucking little mines and shit so you can just throw down on the floor. And get an easy fucking... Kill. What? Oh, this guy's lagging, that's fine. It's legitimately on like one health. Put my fucking barracks. It's really bad, because I'm not that good. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I'm surprised I have like... I have four days of in-game playtime on this game. Two days multiplayer. Only... Exactly two hours zombies. Interesting. We play have about a day and 20 minute, 20 hours. I probably would have had more on League Play compared to multiplayer, but uh, League Play came out like 
what, two to three months after, I think, the game, so... And I played, like, the most amount of, like, Cold War in the beginning. 1.27. KD, that's really low. 0.68, yeah, my win, my win ratio is fucking atrocious. I usually have almost close around to a 2 KD. From, like, Infinite Warfare, Advanced Warfare... Because they started introducing fucking skill-based matchmaking, so really, like I just showed in this fucking games where like, like the, my very very first game was very very good. It was against noobs, basically people were shooting back at me. I was fucking going like 10 and 0 and shit. And then the very literally the very next game, it's like, oh skill-based matchmaking. They put me against fucking try-hard wannabes that have just just like been non-stop playing, and I go like 0 and 10. So I have 1.4 on league play, my KD. So you know. And a wonder when win the loss ratio, so it's not too bad. In my rank, yeah, okay, so silver, yeah, it was level 20. I had exactly 151 losses, 151 wins. Wow, wins to losses, wow. But yeah, hopefully, you guys enjoyed. That was my uh, last stats for that was my last games, my last game, my last couple games, and my last stats. Stats for Call of Duty Cold War, Black Ops Cold War, and now we're going to be moving on to Call of Duty Vanguard. Like I said, uh, I'm going to be playing tomorrow or today, I guess by the time you guys see this, or later on today at like probably nine, around 9 or so, the new COD game. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed. We will see you guys on the next COD or whatever fucking video I post out. Thank you for watching. See you guys in the next one. Peace.